Now, the origins of this subject, um, my understanding is that it originated when um, this degree, the Bachelor of Science and IT degree, included a industry placement year. That was an entire year uh, when they were on industry placement. I do remember um, a student from UTS coming to join our company as part of their placement. Now, for a while it went away, but I believe it's coming back again. Now, uh, most people will get uh, an option of an internship um, as part of their degree. What was happening was that students were going out to industry not actually knowing uh, what was going on. They, they had no idea what happened in, in, in software development and uh, IT related um, placements. So this subject was introduced to step students through a actual software development. So they had some idea of gathering the requirements and doing the design and doing the database design and coding the thing and putting up the tests and writing the documentation. So it went through the, the full project um, in the way of development and it was to give them some exposure to what software engineering involved so that when they went out to industry they had uh, a better idea of what kind of things to expect and what was expected of them and it worked pretty well. Now the, the emphasis is on software engineering, not programming. Uh, the problems that are chosen are deliberately very small. And uh, most, uh, most students would look at it and say, ah, we'll carry that in a couple of weeks. Well, you probably could, but that's not the point. Programming is not software engineering. We want to teach you software engineering. And that involves a certain amount of uh, pre-planning and um, uh, design and then execution and documentation and testing so that the the product is actually engineered not hacked and there's quite a distinction between hacking which I don't think is very professional and software engineering which is very professional now high school students can program you're not high school students you'll be going you're going to be professional software engineers so we we kind of expect you to come up with that standard. Now, evidence from the, the program uh, and the subject in the past is that, for the most part, we're successful. Uh, that is, people come out of the subject knowing a great deal more about software engineering and are well suited, well placed for the industry placement.